could see her window and her curtains were blowing. Tony came running back out and she was screaming. My husband went out to see what was going on and came back in and said that somebody had been killed. It was pretty horrific. I just wanted to change it. I wanted to go back and make it different. I guess part of me thought that it was just a nightmare that we were going to wake up from. Why would somebody want to hurt Mindy? Who would hurt the outgoing, caring, compassionate girl that everybody loved? She was saying, somebody was trying to take me. And I'm like, what? I remember thinking, oh, Mindy, you're being silly, you know. We never did come up with who that person was for sure. I was staring off at the building like, what happened? The word spread so fast, within 30 minutes, there was a lot of people in the front yard of this apartment complex. Is somebody trying to help her? That's what I kept thinking. Is somebody trying to help her? I started collecting statements from everybody that saw her throughout the day. They always say the suspect always comes back to the crime scene because they want to see. What do you think when you got there? First thing I did was realize that I was going to need some more help. Harney was a crime scene guy, and I was a stand-up, knock-on-doors guy, so it worked out. We're really not getting any place with this. You look at every single person like it could be them that did it. I did not feel safe anymore in that building. No one wanted to go out. No one knew if this person was going to kill again. You know, we watched Dateline, but we never in a million years think that's going to be us. 